MyPrimarySinging.com. Today I'm going to share you a little bit more information about my Egg Shaker cards. I just created these. These are part of a series. I have other ones including um, ribbon movement cards, uh, dance scarf cards, and ones for rhythm sticks as well. So this is my fourth one of the series and they're just so fun. So um, there's a lot you can do with an egg shaker and it's easy to just kind of get caught up in, you know, like a simple beat pattern. Um, but there's a lot more that you can do than just like, you know, a slow beat, a fast beat, a fast beat, and a shake constant, you know. So I'm going to demonstrate just a couple of those today and then you can see all of my um, egg shaker cards over on my blog, promotion.com. And they're just a couple dollars to buy as a digital download. And you can download them. They come in the quarter sheet like this or a full page sheet. So depending on your needs and preferences. So this is just one of the pages, for example. And there are 30 different cards included in the set. So, um, but so for example, if you had this card up on the board, it says to swirl the beads and the eggs. So what that looks like is a swirl motion. Gives quite a different sound than a shake, you can notice. Uh, toss and catch, the kids will absolutely love this one. Just tell them to keep the, their tosses really small. Switch hands, obviously would be passed to the other hand. See what kind of distinct sounds already are kind of emerging um, past the partners, kind of to include other people. Um, also, as part of my series, I have different sequences of beat rhythms that you might want to use. So there's the steady beat, there's the every other beat, there's slow, fast, 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 slow. I mean, go double speed. Um, or even like a make your own beat. So there's a couple in particular that I thought might be easier to visualize if you can see them in person. So one is the cage shake. So it was really hard to demonstrate this in a picture, but what you're doing is you're creating a cage around your egg, and then you're shaking like this. And you can actually do this in two ways. You can do it kind of a close, or you can do a more open cage, and they both create the distinct sounds. So that's what the caged shake is. Um, another one is the triangle beat, so it goes away, down, up, away, down, up. And, okay, let's see. Rotate in your palm. And the egg drop. I think the rest are pretty self-explanatory that you'll be able to pick them right up when you grab the printables. So head on over to my blog, primarysinging.com. You can grab all 30 of the different egg shaker patterns. It'll really help you in your primary.